guys welcome back to the channel current time is 11 32 33 now we were supposed to pick up this order at 11.05 in bar taco it's just saying uh very slow now i saw the message from delivered and you know yesterday we got 50 cents extra for waiting today we got a whole dollar a whole dollar guys can you believe that so hopefully we can drop this off fairly quickly hey let's go this is a interesting looking elevator it almost looks like it's a uh, more service type than anything but anyways we're almost there luckily it's super close to bar taco bar taco was so slow Press only ring if there's no assistant on the desk. I don't see her. Yeah, I guess I've just been downstairs. Oh my god, lunch oh, is sorry. Oh, mm -hmm. this is lunch. That's yeah. exciting. Do you have you have to guess where I'm guessing? Uh, Do you? Who is that person? Just ready. Hello. Oh, hello, how are you? I'm good, how are you? You guys ready for some bar taco? Yeah. Yeah. Should I go in there? Should I wait for you guys? Or? Um they have places they want it. Well, let's yeah. walk back. No worries. Let's walk back together. Perfect. I think I know where they want it to place it. Thank you. But it's not in this kitchen, it's in the other kitchen. Oh, okay, okay. No worries. I'll lead you out here. Oh, thank you. Yeah. No problem. I just thought about that. Yeah. I was like, this is probably very confusing. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. You know, it, it really, it twists and turns. Right. It almost and feels like I'm the whole floor. <laughs> it almost feels like it's the whole floor. I brought lunch. Yes, ma'am. So just uh, straight ahead? Yes, the lady okay. in the black boots. That's your, that's your gal. Right. Thank you so much. Yes, sir. The counter right here for you guys? Yes, Perfect. Welcome. Sure, then I'm out of your hair for you. Is there a shortcut to get out of this maze or should I? Okay. So when you go out this way, you want to go right and you make the right, you don't let the person that can get elevated. Okay, sure. Thank you. Oh my goodness, what is that? It smells amazing. Alrighty, guys, we're leaving the drop off here from Delivered. So we got an extra dollar for the weight. So we went up from $30 to $31. We'll go ahead and take that. Ooh. Oh, what is this? Oh, man. Do we, I, I, I don't think it's going to go up, guys. Look. I want to risk it, but I'm not going to because it's still early during lunch. But would you guys have taken this order? I don't know. Fourteen twenty-five for 11 miles. Catering back required from Tate's Bakery and Cafe. I don't know. I feel like the miles and the dollar amount are too close. You know? So we're going to go ahead and just decline that. But, you know, small risk, I guess. Um, or big risk, depending on how you, how you think about it. But anyway, so, okay. So remember how the order from Safety disappeared yesterday? So I wake up today because I had a safety before this order and my ratings went down. So because my ratings went down, I no longer qualify for the order that I had already reserved. So I was like, yo, what kind of BS is this? So I like talked to their support, but now their support is like, oh, you got to email, email us, whatever. So I emailed them and I'm like, yo, I don't understand. It makes no sense. Like I had an order, but then it was gone. I didn't miss it. It was gone. Uh, and then I explained it to them and they were like, oh, it looks like it was a glitch, this and that. So they're like adjusting my rating, but I still lost the, del the delivery for today, which is kind of, which kind of like crappy, you know? So it is what it is, but we got it fixed. So I don't know what issue that was. So I guess next time if I see the order like literally vanishes, I'm just going to talk to them before, <laughs> before, cause that sucked. You know, we missed out on like, I think it was like $24 before this 30 bucks. So then we would have had a $50 head start basically. Um, but yeah. So anyways, got the order dropped out. Oh yeah. By the way, buy a taco. So slow. I got there at 11.05 when the pickup time was 11.05. 
Um, and they were like, oh yeah, we're putting it together. You know that classic, we're bagging it up kind of thing. Ooh, 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 ooh we want to risk it? Yo, I've never seen, okay, you know what? This is gonna be for science. I have never seen a catering bag required order with such a low initial offer. 650, 2.3 miles. We're gonna do this for the science. Catering bag required. If, if we only get 650, you know, whatever. It was 2.3 miles, but I'm just curious. I've never seen one go that low. Um, that went up, I guess. So we'll see here. Uh, let me see. Okay, we're going to our usual pot belly, so hopefully the food's ready. Um, but yeah, so today is actually pretty warm and 60 degrees, um, which is kind of crazy, but Yeah, so anyways today a little bit hectic of a start, but oh by the way We only have a schedule till 1 30 and then we don't have one till 4 30 So, you know, we have a little bit of a gap But I think that's what I'm gonna do anyways because most days from 1 30 to 4 30 is basically dead So, you know, maybe we'll play some more Call of Duty with David. I don't know. Just be at home um, Who knows? But um, that's the plan for, for today We'll see you guys at Potbelly. Let's get it. Hope you guys can hear me. But we're here at Potbelly now. I looked at the items. It's 10, it's like 10 salads, literally. All salads. That's over 100 bucks. I mean, that makes sense. The salad's probably, what, like 12 bucks each? Something like that. Now, I know where it's going. And I've had some great tippers from that building before. And some low tippers from that very same building. So, I guess we'll see. We'll see. Let's see. Hi, Patty. I'm just picking up one for Nancy. So much of salads, right? Okay, cool. Just three bags. Alrighty. Thank you. You're welcome. See you later. Hey, look at that, guys. We're putting up the order as I was getting there. Nice. So the question is, do we even need a catering bag for salads? I'm just gonna put in one so it looks better, but. You know, do we really need one? Probably not. See you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so she saw the food was ready. Could not have timed it any better than that. I was walking in and she was putting it on the shelf. Win win all around. And we're only three minutes away. So even if this doesn't go up from 650, but I think 650 is like a random amount for a catering, catering bag required. I feel like I've seen 625, 925, 950. I don't know. But what do you guys think? Is it gonna go up? I don't know. I feel like it is, but it's not going to be like a huge bang, which I'm not expecting that. They only got salads, you know? Um, I don't know. We'll see. I mean, like I said, we're only two minutes away. Now, it's just to leave it with the receptionist and then to let them know the contact so-and-so. So, that's what we're going to go ahead and do. Um, but, yeah. So, overall, not a bad way to start the day here, even though it was a little bit of a sluggish start from Bar Taco. And it took the sweet time. So, yeah. Anyways, let me get this dropped off. We'll bring you guys along. I think I can. So I don't think that building is one of those secure type buildings. It should be all right. Anyways, we'll see you guys in a here at the drop off location. Now, let's see here. Hopefully somebody's there at the, at the thing to let me in because uh, if not, that would suck. It's one of those scan for access or press the button, I think. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Hello, I have a delivery from Miss Nancy. Okay, come on in. Thank you. Hello. Yeah, it says to give it to the reception, and then it looks like there's an extension for me to give to you to call. I don't know. Yeah, it says hand to reception to have them call me. So. And where is it? Where is it from? Potbelly? Yeah. It's just a bunch of salads, literally. Uh, I just put them in the counter or? Oh, yeah, yeah. Cool, yeah. That's even better. Perfect. No, no, you're fine. No, no worries. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I understand. I just got to take a quick picture of the food and then I'm, I'm gone. Actually, I don't even need a photo. It's all good. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you. Guys, we got the order dropped off, made it back to the town center. <clears throat> I ate some lunch I had already like pre-prepared. Just like, you know, very simple, like ham sandwich, very like plain. And you know, trying to save some, I'm trying to save some money here, you know. When you really add up all how much you spend eating out, it's insane. When you think about it, 
I also eat when I'm at work at my W2. And if I get hungry at two in the morning, which is probably not a good thing, what else is open but Wawa? You know, or Sheets, or even McDonald's. Not the healthy, actually, you know, Wawa, Wawa low key kind of healthy, to be honest. Like, you can find the healthy options. It's just, you feel it in the wallet, you know what I'm saying? Like, being healthy is expensive. <laughs> Very expensive, but anyways, we have our next order here from Now Your Average Joe's catering bag required, showing 625 for like less than three miles. Now, seven items, will it go up? Will it be ready? So many questions, not enough answers here. Um, by the way, by the way, my daughter's birthday is coming up in about two weeks. Uh, March 23rd. I'm so excited. She's gonna be six years old. She's so hyped about it um, And so am I so I, I can't believe she's six You know people always say all oh, the time flies by it literally flies by like I remember holding her when she was first born um, And I always tell her that I was the first person to change her diaper, which is technically true um, Except for the nurse, but you know, I did it um, you know, and then I always, so it's like a little joke saying, oh, mommy was sleeping. <laughs> I mean, of course she just gave him birth, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, we're here at Night Average Joe's. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and hopefully, hopefully, and you know what, I, I think it'll be ready. I think it'll be ready. I think Night Average Joe's is in that kind of place, it's always popping like that, you know? So we'll see what happens, we'll bring you guys along. Let's go. Guys, we're here at Night Average Joe's. Will the food be ready? I mean, it's actually, I don't know if it'll be ready because I want you to like custom, like build your own, this and that, you know. But let me see where it's going. That's another critical part of the equation. 12-0-30. Huh. Definitely an office building. Hand it to me. Okay, okay. We're going to figure that out once, once we get there. But we're actually like 10 minutes early to the pickup time, which maybe it won't be ready because it's so early, you know. But we're going to go ahead and try anyways. Let's see. Yeah. Cool. Hello. Hello. Is this part of this too, or is it separate? For uh, Ceci. Yes. Okay. Cool. Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a good day. Ooh, sorry. Thank you. Have a good day. Hey. Ready? I'm peep. I peeped at the sum total. It's 146 bucks. Okay. 146 bucks. That's a pretty decent sum total. Doesn't mean they're gonna tip though, but it's also going to an office building. So we shall see, we shall see. We'll see you guys on the road. Here at the drop-off location, we got everything in a red catering bag. Uh, I've been to this building a couple times actually. Sweet 300 though, that doesn't sound familiar. But then again, there's like a bajillion offices and whatnot. Oh, by the way, the first place we dropped off the bar taco order at, yo, that office was huge. You know what's crazy that when I came out, I came out from like the other side, like all the way around it. So yeah, their floor space is insane. They might as well have the whole floor. They, they, you know what? They might have the whole floor. Now that I think about it. So I don't know. Let's see here. I got it. Let me see if I can. Blue. Ah, thank you for a uh, Miss Cece. Miss Rico. Cece. 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 It, it might be over there. This is this is three hundred, right? Is this three hundred? This three hundred for Cece. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm pretty sure I got the right building, right? Twelve thirty for Cece. Unless well, she put the wrong. Suite. She must have put the wrong suite because okay. we don't have a CC. Well, I'm going to want to try that side then, real quick. Okay, yeah, but, just go, yeah, try across it because we get a lot of stuff for them. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, you're going to press it? Sorry. Yeah, because we don't even have people in here today. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for that. Let me see here. Hi. Hi. Looking for a CC? Yes. Oh, perfect. Cool. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. And then, just so you know, you actually put on that that suite number. So, oh, I yeah. am very sorry. No, it's okay. No, she she figured it was for you guys. Okay. So. Do you want me to check? I can leave it. It's, it's up to you. I mean, it's not, it's not that much stuff. Okay, perfect. But no she's like, yeah, we get stuff all the time. And then she's like, it's gotta be for them because there's nobody in the office on that side. Yeah. So. I do apologize. No, it's okay. I appreciate you very no much. No worries. She's gonna give you a call if it wasn't this one. But thank enjoy. you so much. Have, Have a good day. Rest of your day. Thank you too. Thank you. You already dropped off. Guys, what do you think about this Bronco? I'm not gonna lie, it looks nice. I'm more of a Jeep person, but this Bronco ain't bad. You know which car I also really like when it comes to this type of style? 
the, the Toyota FJ Cruiser, those are so beautiful. But they're so expensive. You can find one nowadays because they don't make them anymore. They're so expensive. Anyways, current time is 1244 and we're sitting, I think it's 60 bucks if I'm not mistaken. So not too bad for only doing three orders. You know what I mean? Current time is 1245. Now we're here until 130. So kind of running out of time. Let's right, go. guys, so to drop in off the last order, we're chilling, and the next thing you know, my dash ended. So I thought it ended at 1.30, ended at 1. So we're finishing up the first part of the shift here at like 60 bucks. Not great, not too crazy, but still not bad. Um, so we're going to come back at around 4, 4 p.m. or so. So we're going to head home for a little bit, relax, and then we'll see you guys in a couple hours. Let's go. Okay, guys, guys, we're back outside. So after doing the last drop off, we made it back. The dash ended, didn't get anything. Went home, played some more COD with David from the Nola grind. That was pretty fun, actually. We had a, we almost won. We we're close. We we're close. Um, but here we are, back outside. Current time, 4:15, and I've gotten two offers so far. Both of them trash. So we'll see. I think we're sitting at 60 bucks. I want to make 150. So we need to have like a really good three and a half hours basically um so we'll see if we can make that happen let's go hey guys so here we are at the town center look at the order that i got i'm not gonna lie i kind of regret not taking this for science and for content uh so I fumbled the bag my bad but if i get another one like this i'll take it and it wasn't terrible but look from south lakes high school what <laughs> high schools are using doordash now it's nine drop-offs for 27 25 guaranteed now, what am I dropping off though? You know, all the ways are picked up by the same. Yeah, it's a high school. I want, I'm so curious. So it's paying $27.25 for 11.7 .7 miles, but it's nine drop offs. You know, I, I don't know. Part of me should, I feel like I should have taken it for the science of it. Um, so my bad. But have you guys seen an order from high school before? I, I think I, I don't think I've ever seen one like that from a high school. What, what, what could it be? Girl Scout cookies? I don't know. I don't think a high school would do that. I don't even know. I'm so, I'm so like interested, but at the same time, I'm kind of bummed that I didn't take it. So, my bad. I mean, look at the order that we got a little bit after that. Two twenty-five for six point eight miles from Buller's Barbecue. That order is not getting picked up for a while because it's going to the middle of nowhere. Current time is four twenty-five. Cannot believe we fumbled. We fumbled. We fumbled the bag like that, guys. That was my bad. But I saw it and I was like, "What is this?" Like I was like, twenty-seven, twenty-five. 12 miles and nine drop-offs so it's not terrible when you think about it and i think he was projecting it for me to take an hour so an hour for 27 bucks that's pretty good um so yeah low-key regretting it it is what it is kind of thing so yeah anyways we're just chilling right now waiting to get an offer so we'll see you guys in hey a bit. guys guys we're on the road here we're moving moving around we're going to 7-eleven 825 four miles nothing crazy i just want to do something and i know the 7-eleven is going to be ready and it's most of the miles are for me to the 7-Eleven, so not so bad. And what if maybe when we finish and then we get the order from the high school again? That would be pretty cool if we get it again. Then I would take it. Um, but yeah, so anyways, we're going to make our way to 7-Eleven. We'll see you guys there. Let's go. Alrighty, guys, here we are at the 7-Eleven. Will the order be ready? It's actually a good amount of stuff. Uh, and of course, you know, you get your alcohol and you get your candies. Why not? Uh oh, it's not a good sign, guys. Not a good sign. Did they have a light and bait at 7 Eleven? Cool. Did I know that? I think it's right here on my right. An order for Taylor. It's uh, five items. Thank you, sir. Have a good day. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, guys, we're leaving the 7-Eleven. As you saw, the food was ready. I don't know. Every time I go that, to that 7-Eleven and I tell them who I'm picking up for, they always go to the little machine. Maybe they dispatch it. I don't know. But it was ready. Uh, and yeah, and they had the door open to the back, and I saw they had live bait. I didn't know 7-Eleven sold live bait. Uh, that's pretty cool, actually. But anyways, we're three minutes away, so we're basically almost there. We're one light away, and then just a little bit of road over there this will put us i think almost at 70 bucks 
say we're, 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 we're really far from uh, you know where I want to be at uh, 150 and it's 445 so we got less than three hours to get to 150 I mean it's gonna be it's gonna be a tough one but I think we can you know we, we can make it happen hopefully hopefully but I've been enjoying the last two days just going home doing those slow times because it is so slow you know what I mean so as long as I schedule myself accordingly it's not a problem but I think I might do it from a because today I did it from 1130 to 1 so I think 1130 11 11 30 to 1 30 or 11 to 1 30 it's fine and then you know come back around four around this time so but then that's that is working out at least so far tomorrow though a little bit different we are going to be in Arlington but tomorrow we're going to be there like all day so tomorrow's going to be one of those grind type of days we'll see what it has what the day has in store for us um but it'll be fun so anyways let me get this dropped off we'll see you guys in a bit hey guys so we're leaving the drop off now it does have an extra dollar because they have an alcohol peak pay which I wish would tell you it's already included in the initial offer, you know. So like for example, it would show seven twenty-five thing at the bottom, plus one for the alcohol peak. You know how they do it for like heavy pay or whatever, kind of like that. I wish it would show it like that, you know. Because then in my mind I'm thinking, you oh, know, it's eight twenty-five, it'll be nine twenty-five, you know. But I mean I didn't realize there was a peak until like after I accepted the order, after I dropped it off. I mean so. Anyways, current time four fifty, uh, and we have what. 68 25 in the bag kind of far from the goal anyways we'll see you guys on the next one alrighty guys so we're back at the town center I'm not saying the best driver but look at this parking job by this Lexus like more of the car is out on the road than he's in a parking spot I really hope you all can see this um, but yeah now we're just chilling waiting you know just declining looking for offers looking for offers looking for offers um, but yeah that's a terrible parking job Anyways, we'll see you guys in a few. Alrighty guys, finally, after waiting for, man, I felt like forever. We have two orders, paying $21 for like, I think, four or five miles from Chipotle and Tate's Bakery. So we're gonna go to Chipotle first, uh, see the food's ready there. But yeah, <laughs> excuse me, definitely not as busy as yesterday, as I feel like it, but in the end, it's, you know, you need a little bit of luck, and maybe today we're not as lucky as we were yesterday, so there's that. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? Good to see you, bro. You busy today? It's okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, Robert. Robert. Thank you so much. Thank you. Guys, so here we are. Going to see if the order from the bakery place is ready. Hopefully. I wonder if they're using the uh, shelf again or do I have to ask them every single time for the order because that would suck. Okay guys, we got both orders picked up. So the one from Tate's was not ready but they were just bagging it up really didn't wait that long we have a 12 minute drive to the first drop off uh, and then probably five minutes to the second drop off but yeah, i'm just glad i'm happy that the order came through and in my mind what i could think about was man we should have taken that order from the high school just try it out you know the order from south lakes high school but i'm just trying to think i'm what could it be you know i'm just thinking it's gotta be cookies i don't know it's gotta be something i don't know um, so I'm, I'm, I'm kind of like mad. I'm really mad actually that I didn't take the order just because I wanted to figure it out what it was. But anyways, current time, 535 and 150 seems like an eternity away. So we're going to do our best. We'll see you guys in a few. Hey guys, guys, so we got the orders dropped off. And let me tell you, the second drop off was a pain. It's literally to a house that's just been built. So Google, like I don't even think Google knows it's already like there. So like it took me to this random road where the houses are being built and I'm like, okay, let me look for the one that's actually like finished, you know? So I ended up calling the guy and I was like, hey, uh, Google says that I'm here, but I don't see anybody like here. And then I was like one street over basically. I got that dropped off. I was driving back, wasn't getting anything. I'm like, yo, this is not cool. We're not getting much. Uh, kind of slow Thursday, I guess. And then this one comes along from BGR and um total wine 17.75 i think or 17 bucks i forget what much it said but we got the order from bgr picked up and then we're gonna drop that off first and then head to total wine uh current time is 618 so i think after we drop after we drop these two off 
we might have enough time to do one or two more orders if we're lucky so 150 it's looking extremely unlikely unless we get an absolute banger of an order which technically is possible so you know i'm not gonna say that we're out of the race yet but uh we're definitely you know towards the bottom of the grid if you will so yeah anyways let me get this order dropped off and we'll see you guys in a few ready guys so we got the first order dropped off and look where we're at my favorite place total wine now the order is very small it's literally one bottle uh from mr brian actually not a bottle one item he got he has some uh, flying dogs ipas um so yeah I don't know, I think for me online, if I'm gonna order online and pay a delivery fee and all these things, I'm just gonna order a bunch. You're gonna drink it anyways. So why, why, why just order one thing, you know? Maybe that's just me though. Maybe I'm a little bit different. You guys let me know in the comments. And nobody's there, so we're gonna have to press the button. How's it going, sir? Pretty good, I'm just picking up for a Brian. Right, cool. so we got the order so picked much. up there from Total One Extra Star. It was ready, of course. Now we're eight minutes away, 3.1 miles. Now, in a perfect world, after I drop this off, we'll get a banger either from Fintai or from your mom, our mom, our, not your mom, our mom, <laughs> Eugenia, whatever the place is called, because uh, it's going to be right near there. So hopefully we can make that happen. It's 6.35 right now, um, so we're running out of time. So, yeah. Anyways, we'll see you guys. And if you guys, we got the order dropped off. We got both of them dropped off. My bad. Uh, but the total wine order had a $9 tip. So he almost bought himself a whole nother pack. Shout out to Mr. Brian. Uh, current time is 6.45, guys. 6.45. And I know we're over 100, but we're nowhere near 150. You know what I mean? So that's kind of, you know, it is what it is. But plenty of time, though. We still have basically like 35, 40 minutes before we call the quits. So we're lucky we get one of those banger orders. Not gonna lie. Um, David sent me a message, you know, from the Nola grind. Um, I like that they were good friends. We talk about random stuff. We've uh, we play Call of Duty together. That's that's a bond right there. You know what I'm saying? Um, but he, he sent me a text saying that the Dasher rewards have basically entered his market, and our markets are very similar. We see a lot of the same things, so maybe I'll see the same thing soon. You know, and that's gonna be a whole other journey into our our DoorDash. Uh, journey i guess man all these stacks that are trash uh but anyways so i'm curious to see how that's gonna affect you know his dashing and whatnot i know he's basically all about delivered that and delivered and doing the catering apps and whatnot but you know i've seen him fill in a couple of um catering bag require orders in between so we'll see how that affects it um i know if it, if it ever comes to my market uh, i i can't even change my style of dashing because i would just take I, I guess I just wouldn't see those catering bag required orders and I would just take the orders that I normally took You know 625 650 whatever as long as the miles aren't crazy So anyways, we're gonna go ahead and chill in the same parking lot. We were chilling yesterday That has the Finta, the glory days that could go to Trattoria place so We're gonna go ahead and chill there. Hopefully, you know, we get an order. We don't we don't but I like to think that we can make that happen We'll see you guys on the next okay, guys 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 the wait was not long. We waited maybe two, three minutes, and we got an order from Gregorio Statoria. We just picked it up, six twenty-five. One item, one tiny pizza that's eighteen dollars, and you know what? It's just a cheese pizza, which is wild. If I'm gonna pay eighteen dollars, you best believe we gotta add some toppings, you know. But then I bet you'd be more than twenty bucks if you had the toppings, you know. So, anyways, it's only gonna be a four-minute drive. So overall, less than six, seven minutes from originally accepting the order. That's a W right there. Hoping they stack it. We declined a couple of orders though. I declined like a, a couple of 525 orders. You know, I really want to stick with the uh, 625 or higher range, especially for dinner. The only times that would take like a 525, it's gotta be super dead or it's the slow times or it's breakfast. For breakfast, I'm a little more lenient, you know? Um, but we'll see, we'll see. Anyways, current time is 657. So the clock is against us. Will the order move? I doubt it. Um, I think it's gonna stay at 625 and that's cool. I mean, you know, they're already paying 18 bucks for the pizza Then you gotta add the fees and stuff. So, you know, they're probably paying almost $30 Insane mind blown and they live so close if I live this close and I saw those fees You know, I'll get that sticker shock and I'd be like, you know what? I really want it. Let me take my butt to the pizza place or whatever, you know, so anyways We'll see you guys in a bit. Okay guys guys. We got the order from Gregorio Statoria dropped off instead of 625 as expected and now we're out of time. I made it back to the little parking lot where I was at chilling. 
and we did not get anything. I mean, the orders that I was getting were absolutely terrible. So now we're just gonna drive to the W2 and just, you know, keep it going, I guess. But, you know, we fell short. We were about like 40 something dollars short, I think. Or, yeah, I mean, I think we finished around not even 120, which I think 125 would have been like a nice, you know, um, second place kind of thing. But it's all good. We, I think we made 113. It's on the screen. Whatever we made, it's on the screen. It could always be worse. Uh, so tomorrow, I'm expecting a major day. We're, we're gonna be out most of the day, so we might not drive too much into the night like I normally do uh, on Fridays, but we'll see, we'll see. Anyways, remember to like and subscribe. We're almost a six, we need like 97 more people. And we're gonna be at a 6,000 subs. Can't believe that, that's crazy. Shout out to you guys. Um, but yeah, anyways, we'll see you guys on the next one. Stay safe, peace.